Have you ever been driving when suddenly you hear a random chime or notice a light come on on your dash that wasn't there when you started on your journey? Well, there are two types of lights that pop up in your dashboard, indicator lights and warning lights. Being able to differentiate between the two is very important, so we wanted to help you understand exactly what each of these lights mean and what your next step should be if that light comes on in your Ford. When you see a light up here on your dashboard, you may feel like you're in trouble. If it's an indicator light, you don't have to worry. They appear as a blue or green color and are simply reminders or notifications of systems that are activated. The high beam indicator. When you activate your high beams, this light will pop up on your dashboard to remind you that these lights are on. The trunk ajar light. This light simply means that you haven't closed your trunk all the way and you should make sure it's shut before you continue driving. There are also indicators for passenger doors. Adaptive cruise control. Once you turn on cruise control, the speed control system indicator light changes color to just show the system mode. A white light illuminates when the adaptive cruise control system is turned on. A green light illuminates when the adaptive cruise control system is engaged or actively in use. The direction indicator. When you activate a turn signal, you'll see the indicator light blinking on your dashboard. Auto start stop. This illuminates to alert you when your engine is shutting down. A corresponding message may also be displayed. Fasten safety belt. This lights up while a chime sounds to remind you to fasten your safety belt. It's important to differentiate between indicator and warning lights. Warning lights are generally red or orange. If they come on while you're driving, it means there's an issue with one of your vehicle's components. If you see the light blinking, you should pull over to safety and immediately make arrangements with your authorized Ford dealer. Brake system light. If your brake system light appears on your dashboard while you're in motion, check to see if your parking brake is engaged. If it's not, it could mean low brake fluid level or a malfunction. You should have your brake system checked immediately. Driving with malfunctioning brakes is not advised for your safety and the safety of others. The anti-lock braking system. If this is illuminated while you're driving, a malfunction is indicated. The normal braking system without ABS will continue to function unless the brake system warning lamp is also illuminated. Have the system checked by your authorized dealer. Engine coolant temperature. If this light comes on, it means your engine is running hot. It'll soon overheat and fail to function properly. It is advised you pull over to safety and turn the engine off to let it cool down. If the problem persists, please contact your Ford dealer. The battery light. When this light turns on while you're driving, it means there's a malfunction with your battery or charging system. You should turn off all unnecessary electronics to get to a safe location in time. You should also contact your Ford dealer immediately. Low Tire Pressure Warning Light Your tire pressure monitoring system will send this alert to your dashboard when it senses that one or more of your tires is underinflated and requires your attention. If you're near a gas station, fill up your affected tire to its appropriate level. Electronic Parking Brake This lights up when the electronic parking brake has a malfunction. Get it checked at the dealer. Engine Oil If illuminated while the engine is running or you're driving, a malfunction is indicated. Stop your vehicle as soon as it is safe to do so and switch the engine off. Check the engine oil level. If you find that your engine oil is at the appropriate level yet the warning lamp remains lit, do not resume driving. Have the system checked by your authorized dealer immediately. The Front Airbag a malfunction is indicated if this warning lamp fails to illuminate when you start your vehicle, continues to flash, or remains on. Have the system checked by their authorized dealer. Powertrain Fault A wrench illuminates when a powertrain or all-wheel drive fault has been detected. Contact your authorized dealer as soon as possible. Service Engine Soon If the Service Engine Soon indicator light stays lit after you've started the engine, the Onboard Diagnostic Systems, or OBD, has detected a malfunction of the vehicle's emission control system. Contact your authorized dealer as soon as possible. If the indicator light is blinking, an engine misfire may be occurring, which could damage your Cadillac converter. Drive in a moderate fashion and avoid heavy acceleration and deceleration and have your vehicle serviced immediately. The service engine soon indicator light illuminates when the ignition is first turned on in order to test the bulb, as well as indicate whether the vehicle is ready for inspection or maintenance testing. Normally, the service engine soon light will stay on until the engine is cranked, then turn itself off if no malfunctions are present. 
Now that you know the difference between four dashboard indicator lights and four dashboard warning lights, you'll be ready when one appears. You can always contact us at Richmond Ford Lincoln for more information or assistance should a warning light appear. And remember, we are driven by you.